While much of Eric Holder's hearing focused on President Clinton's decisions to pardon Mark Rich and to commute the sentence of the Puerto Rican independence activists, he was never asked about Clinton's decision not to pardon Native American activist Leonard Peltier. Peltier was convicted three decades ago in a controversial trial of the killing of two FBI agents on the Pine Ridge Reservation in South Dakota. He's long maintained his innocence. On Wednesday night, I spoke with Native American novelist and poet Louise Erdrich about Leonard Peltier. I sat through that trial as a young person, and I listened to all the evidence, and I heard it all, and there was no way I could see that this person would be convicted. There simply wasn't evidence. Um, and he was convicted. He received two life sentences, consecutive life sentences, and is in, is in, in uh, incarcerated to this day. Um, although human rights organizations all over the world have called for his release. Do you think your writing could literally liberate someone? No. I tried to write. Um, uh, I, there was a, I had an op-ed published hoping that um, President Clinton would pardon Leonard Peltier. That did not happen. We all know who got pardoned instead. <laughs> you might remember that was Mark Rich. Yeah. Um, I have hopes, but I... In fact, Clinton went around at that time, uh, went on a tour uh, to Native American reservations, and many people appealed for him to grant clemency for Leonard Peltier. It, it, Leonard is an incredible symbol to people, and he's a symbol of the sacred trust between these two countries, our, our, our domestic dependent countries, and the United States of America. We're different countries, although we're one. That is Louise Erdrich uh, in New York uh, talking about her new book, The Red Convertible. One of her stories is loosely based or refers to the case of Leonard Peltier. This is Democracy Now!, democracynow.org, The War and Peace Report. This week, Leonard Peltier was moved to a federal prison in Waymark, Pennsylvania. Juan?